<laughs> hey guys, quick little instructional video on how to put together your glue caddy. That features holders for all kinds of bottles, the glue bot as well. And again, this is what it's gonna look like when it's all put together. Now, if you've gotten this video because you scanned a QR code, thank you for your purchase. If you've gotten it just because you've seen it on the second channel, hey, the link's down below to get one if you'd like. So without further ado, let's get uh, assembling this thing. First of all, thank you so much for your support. And secondly, also, this is an inventory of what you should have upon opening your package. So there is a specific order to put this thing together, and I'm going to show you that here. I like using CA glue with activator as it gives me the quickest bond, although you can use regular wood glue if you'd like. First, we're going to take the back and the bottom, and we're going to put them together just like this. CA glue on one side and activator on the other, and you're going to see here it gives a quick bond just like so. And now, moving on to the next step. Now it's time to attach the top, and I do it the exact same way with some CA glue on one side, activator on the other. Nestle it in place, and you've got yourself a piece now that stands on end. I like to keep the bottom towards me, and then put one of the feet on. This is the left foot. You can see there it says glue on it. Now there's one of two ways to do this. You can either flood the box joints dry with CA glue, and then put the activator on them, and you've got a nice hold there. Or you can simply just do it the way we've been doing it by putting some CA glue on the edges, activating the sides, but afterwards, it works pretty well as well. So there's a lot of ways you can do this, but that's pretty much the gist. Now, for the front supports, you don't wanna forget these. These are kind of what the whole thing does and ties the whole thing together, makes it really strong. I've gone ahead and branded the left side of this. If you would like to put my logo there, great. If not, guess what? You can always turn it around, but I'm partial to me, so there you go. I'm going to put my glimpse inside mustache man in the bottom left corner. And once these pieces are glued in place, you're done. It's as strong as it can be with the French cleats built in. Now it's time to fill her up. Ah, but before we fill it all up, let's just take a look at it. Looks good, huh? All right, onto the French cleat wall, and we're going to fill it up with all the supplies. So I'm going to show you here that having pencils and Sharpies and glue brushes around is really handy. But don't forget to use those pencil holders for some drinking straws because, you know, every once in a while you need to get glue squeezed out of a 90 degree corner. And this works really well. Now, on to loading up some of the adhesives. You know what? Type on is pretty much what I use, but some people use Gorilla Glue. And it has a larger diameter bottle. No worries. Got that covered. Glue bots, popular demand. I was prototyping this. Everyone was asking to make sure it had a spot for a glue bot, so here you go. Wish granted. I think it turned out pretty nice. So the French cleats are built in just in case you are outfitted with them. However, don't let that be a deciding factor. If you don't have them, this thing can just sit on a shelf. It could sit on a workbench. It's its own standalone unit without the cleat system as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was a really fun prototype to make. I got my final thoughts on it here. Thank you so much. So there it is. I hope you got something out of it. I hope this uh, instructional video was pretty easy to follow. And if you don't have one for yourself, of course, links are down below. Fun project to make, fun product to actually develop, and I hope you guys get a lot of major use out of this. And also, the Starbond CA glue holder as well. If you don't know about that, I've got an instructional video on this channel as well. So here you go. Thanks for joining me. Appreciate you guys and all the support thus far, and hope you enjoy. Take care.